Well, we'll get ready to walk the plank when we come back. Pirate William from the oldest city, her, joins us next. <laughs> One of the best prep basketball players from the first coast is finally back on the court after he overcame what could have been a fatal illness. That's coming up in sports. If you head to St. Augustine, odds are that you might run into a pirate. The nation's oldest city has many attractions that feature pirates, and this morning we have one of those pirates joining us. William Mayhem is the pirate magician of St. Augustine. Thank you so much for coming in. I will thank you for the invite, my dear. <laughs> I thank you. Now tell us, you are a magician, and this is that's how you, you, you've been doing magic a much longer than you've been pirate. I If I stepped out of my voice, yes, I've been doing <laughs> magic for 35 years professionally. I, and then when I came back to St. Augustine, I stepped into this voice, and now <laughs> I'm a pirate. And, and how did that come about? I, I, it was piratical, I guess. Just one be, day you woke up and thought. Well, I thought, what kind of a character <laughs> would be great for the oldest city in the United States? Mm -hmm. A pirate. Mm -hmm. And what would be so magical? A magical pirate. So I decided that's how I would do it. And you're originally from St. Augustine, too. I have four or five generations of family in St. Augustine. Yeah, so kind of so, back home for you. Yeah, it was nice to come back home. I've yeah. been away and traveling around for many, many years, much like a pirate would be doing. <laughs> uh -huh. Aye, so it's been good. It's been a lot of good. Yeah, and it has been good. I mean, recently you've been nominated for a very prestigious Pirates Award. Tell yes. us about that. Pirates Magazine. Uh, decided back in April to put out the call to all the pirate groups in the United States mm -hmm. to submit their captains. I happen to be the captain of the St. Augustine Swashbucklers. They submitted me for that prestigious chance yeah. to be one of the devil's dozen of the pirate lords of the United States. So now it's down to 23. I don't know how many there were finally, but mm -hmm. there are now 23 finalists as of Thanksgiving, and I'm one of the 23. And the only one in Florida left. I am the only Florida Hanging pirate on. left. And um, a devil's dozen, that's 13? 13, 13, okay. 13, and you can go to piratesmagazine.com, mm -hmm. look for the devil's dozen logo, look for the word vote above it, and go and look for Master William Mayhem, the pirate magician of St. Augustine, and give me a vote. That's the only yeah. way that I'm going to make it now. Yeah, cast your vote, and you have until when? February 2nd is the deadline for oh, that. Okay, that's coming up then. I, it is, it oh, is. Okay, and as we mentioned, I mean, you are a magical pirate. I am a magical pirate. So we want to see some of your work and what well, people can see if you're on the ship, and we have a dollar here. See, now that's a dollar that you owned, right? Uh -huh. Of yes, course it is. It is. <laughs> so what we'll do is we'll just take that dollar, now, pirates are all about money. If you watch this money, as we fold it down to the very smallest piece it can be, are you watching it closely I'll, now? I'm very, yes. All right, now watch. My eyes aren't moving. See, that kind of dollar isn't any good to a pirate, but the dollar here is actually perfect for a pirate. Amazing, I was just intently looking, how did you? I did it quite well and quite yes. magically. <laughs> yes, That's how I, I did guess it. so. And there you go. Look at that. It's from the state of Florida from a fabulous. very, very long time ago. Oh, wow. Absolutely fabulous. Thank you so much. And I know you have some more tricks up your sleeve. So I do. We'll, we'll try to do something yeah. else in a little bit. Yeah, in a few minutes. We'll come back with you. William, thank you so much well, for being here. Well, thank you very we much. appreciate it. Thank you. Well, that will be back in a bit. But coming up, what exactly is happening to Jay Leno's night show? We'll try to clear fact from fiction.